What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I am Steve and this is our Massilia campaign in the Divinit and Paramod. Uh, firstly, if you guys enjoy this video, hit that like button and uh, be sure to follow us for some more strategy and city builder content. Uh, speaking of city builders, the next video will be the settlement survival game. It's a very colorful banished like game with some social and cultural aspects, which is a lot of fun. I played it last year or earlier in the year when it came out um, on alpha or beta, I can't remember, but it was fully released this month. So I wanted to give it another go. So we'll do, we'll do one of those and see how you guys like that. Cause we are all being patient with manor lords. So where we have to, we have to find something in the meantime. Um, but yeah, so this should be episode four. If you guys want to see the other uh, episodes, be sure to hit the uh, playlist. I think it pops up in the back of the, at the end of the video. And in the last episode, we went and marched on Tolosa. We took it and we now have no more enemies. I think we are, we're cool with everybody. Uh, the, these uh, Sesatani, they are not, they're not very uh, friendly towards us, but they are a treacherous bunch. So it makes, makes sense. Um, I think we're, how are you guys with me? You guys are not the biggest fans of me, but there is a buffer between the two of us. And you guys are not fans of me. I don't want to mess too much. I definitely don't want uh, to be hostile with Liguria because I want them to be a buffer between Rome and I. Because I want to be Rome's left arm, uh, pretty, pretty literally. So I and I and if we take that, if we take Genoa, we're gonna be antagonizing some war. Uh, but anyways, let's uh, let's try and you know, let's try to be cool with people. And let's actually, who do you guys have any enemies? No, you guys are cool with them. You guys are very friendly with them. So it turns out if we go to war, if we go to war with them, they're probably gonna join in, and vice versa. Um, let's can't trade with them. How are you guys? Do you guys want to be cool? You guys want to do train agreement? No. Um, not aggression pact? Okay. They're pretty powerful, actually. They, it looks like they only have... They probably only have one. Oh, they're actually at war with Liguria. Oh, snap. They're not... They're like whatever with us. We should have done this in the beginning of the game. We do have a non-aggression, so that's good. I want to eventually take this settlement. So maybe we don't do anything with that. Uh, let's trade. No, I think we... I want to say we've done this already. And no one wanted to trade with us. For some reason, everyone hates us. Um, Liguria, they definitely don't want to trade. They can trade. I mean, we could... Non-aggression. Trade? No. Okay. No one's even countering me. Like, they want nothing to do with me. That's fine. Um, I guess for now, we can kind of just build tall. And uh, beans, we just took over Tolosa and united our uh, our province here. Oh. We can uh, just kind of kind of chill for a little bit and get get some stability going. And, uh, yeah, break it, rake in that money. And we're going to leave these guys here, just in case, because these seem to be more hostile. I know we don't have any friends up there, but they seem to be the most hostile. So let's, before we leave, let's make sure everyone in my family tree, which is super small, apparently, is having kids. So they got, they got kids, so they, they got, got a male heir there, and we, Cyrene, probably female. Or a locust? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who uh, who he or she is. All right, so it looks like we're doing pretty good. Um, Fifty-seven percent council of the six hundred. That's such a cool name. The inland traders, the Italian traders, and the populace. The likes Romans. Likes Romans. And theirs is just influence. Republic. The power belongs to the people. I like it. Um, 
Which one populate? You know what? Let's secure some loyalty. Actually, you know what? Is that loyalty breakdown? Yeah. They're not a big fan of the Republic? Aren't you guys technically a Republic as well? No? I like the inland traders. They're pacifists. I guess we get a debuff for that. Oh, for each... Nah, that's a bad thing. But they like Romans too. So, alright, so what is this? Influence. And loyalty breakdown. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's do that. A political intrigue has developed. We're becoming friendly with the Italian... The Italian traders. Alright, we got some... We got some money coming in. I don't want to necessarily get rid of anybody. Because... Eh, yeah, well, we can get rid of these guys. We don't need them. Alright. Um, you sure you want to turn in your turn? Oh, do we have, uh, we have some skills? Ah, right here. Did we fight a battle with him? Hmm. Polis defenders. Spears, wall breachers. Yeah, let's do, let's do defense there. And Stalwart City Defenders. Because this is... I do want this to be more of a defensive. Let's do that. I was just thinking, like, what if we just did a bunch of buffs that um, help morale, and then we just basically have armies of... in Like, in... Uh, uh, what am I, what's the word I'm thinking of? Like, immortal... Not immortal, but, like, they just never retreat... They're unbreakable. That's the word I was looking for. So we'll do that. I hate that this flipping thing doesn't disappear. What is this? Army supply? Regional foraging? Oh, okay. So this is our... Oh, they're action points. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what the army supply is. Uh, but anyways, let's work on... Morale. The logistician would be pretty good. Uh, but this isn't a very expensive army, I don't think. But let's do it. The next one, we'll, do, we'll work more on morale as well. Um, this army is looking pretty formidable. Would like to see some more horses, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, let's end our turn. Oh, yeah, we do have a uh, provincial... Uh... Oh, my gosh, I'm, like, totally blanking now. It's been so long since I played this game, it feels like. But we've got Brendan Games going on. Um, but we can take the food hit, so that's why we're doing it. All right, we got an increase in rank. Noble woman, rank three. Nice. Good job, good job. You love to see it. I don't know what I want to use her for. I think it's um public order. That's I think that's what I'm. I think that's what I'm going for here. Is it because I already have? Oh, it's because I already have the others. 
I gotcha. Let's do... What's her, uh... Authority, cunning... So, cunning... Uh, any capacity of uh, subterfuge and espionage. Okay, authority, strength of character, measure of effective assertiveness. Let's get her authority up. Let's do that. Let's do upkeep for all. Okay, yeah, that'll be good. Oh man, she's got some. She's got some hacking upgrades. And we could do the bureaucrat as well. Awesome. We're going to have to get some more of them. That is super useful. Alright, we got some upgrades, though. Uh, Tolosa. Hello, hello. Um, so, public order is getting better. Food could also be... Could also be better. Oh, that's our supply, supply food. Okay, so what we got here is Celtic immigrants. Okay, so... Okay, I see what we got. I see... Um, Gallic Outpost, Hellenic Outpost. I do want to do a Hellenic Outpost. And I got Homesteading and Local Agora. Open Ground is an opportunity for the wise, public order, growth, and second class citizens. Uh, maybe we do Consecrated Ground. Because this will help with the conversion uh, into a Hellenic culture. And then maybe going into a Hellenic outpost. And it'll help with sanitation as well. Do we have sanitation problems? Uh, it doesn't necessarily say that we do. Or here we do. Got a little bit of, little bit of squala. So let's do let's do the consecrated ground. It'll help with that. We got over here the shrine of Ares. Uh, shrine of Zeus, Grove, Poseidon. Which one is the? Um, Hephaestus. Hephaestus. Uh, plus ten percent from industry. Hermes protects those who travel far and those athletes who run quickly. All right, so Athena, she'll be good with research. Okay, so that's good. Um, research and sanitation, big pluses. Well, sanitation, I guess, comes with it anyway. Uh, Plus one security against all Asian actions. Shrine of Zeus. I would like to go for like a more mercantile. Mercanti mercantile shrine. So we'll leave it. We'll do that. And this army is good to go. So what are you guys doing? We can fortify. And does it help with... Okay, so it does take away some food. Uh, we can go into ambush. We go into raiding. Obviously, we don't want to ra uh, raid. Forces in the stands cannot initiate battles. Forces in the stands have always are always ambushed when attacked. Forces in the stands cannot muster new units. So what's like... What's the real benefit of this? I mean, I guess it helps with public order, but... The public order is fine. Um, okay. I do want to move these guys over here. Just in case we get attacked. And we should have... Yeah. It's not a, not the best garrison, but the garrisons in this game are pretty light. So, um, yeah. I guess nothing else for us to do. Uh, we could try and try and do some negotiating again. We'd like to. Let's see. Non-aggression pact? Yeah, I didn't think so. You want to do trade? No? Okay. 
Military access. I mean, I guess they're not going to like us too much because um, we are more Hellenic. Okay, so do we have trade with them and Rome? I wonder how Liguria is doing. Ooh. Hopefully that's not all they have left. And we can also actually recruit another agent. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Get another noble woman. And we can help with her with her zeal. Yeah, she'll, she'll come over here. I'm going to guess Narbo is... What is Narbo? What is the culture? I guess the province is all, all one now. So, the cultural stuff is just kind of the way it is, I guess. Cultural differences, definitely going down though, so that's good. And they do good with characters, is that is that what I saw? How about that? How about that? Alright, so uh, my characters should be upgrading at all? Yeah, I don't know how old these guys are. One? One? Zero, okay, so that's a, that's a new one right there. How old are you? You're 27? Okay, so you got you got some years left on you. We just gotta keep you alive. Tensions in Sicily. Carthage is getting the upper hand in Sicily on its way to complete control over the island of Sicily. They say Sicily a lot. Carthage has angered Roman interests in this area. Oh, snap. All right, so got Mysteries of the Eleusis. Um, plus four Hellenic culture to all regions and plus four public order. Love it. Gotta, gotta love it. All right, so Thales, uh, we got a Coin Forger, and uh, Unseasonal Conditions, okay. Construction Report, we got a Market Settlement and Fishing Port done, awesome. And nothing else we could build, so that's fine. So I want to, eventually we want to get ready to go to war with these guys. Because um, we, you know, we are traders, we are seafarers, um, I feel like proper we should have you know a navy first off and second off we should have control a lot of a lot of uh, coastal cities so that's kind of kind of my uh my go-to like i don't want to go too far inland like spain I, I could i could take over completely because it's you know it's a peninsula i wouldn't mind a few inland settlements but i don't really have a lot of interest going up here um, unless they force me to but i hope they don't all right so this noble woman can't tell okay we are just flat out moving this one hellenic hellenic okay we'll do that and you do your thing over there all right so don't want to do too much with the army there uh just because i do want to kind of really bolster our coffers for a bit so we're not going to do a whole lot but once these buildings get done things will get a lot things get a lot better um so yeah uh but anyways if if you guys have any like you know advice or ideas like feel free to throw them in the comments uh for one it helps the algorithm and for two it'll i think it'll make for a better experience for all of us and uh I, like i said like i don't have a whole lot of experience with this mod so um or this game it's been so long so I think it'd be it'd be useful advice. Ah, uh, we got a child born. Awesome. Most joyous news. A healthy child is born. A future pillar of the family and the people. Haiti. Sounds like uh sounds like we got ourselves a female. Alright, we got tax labor. Completed that research. We got another household. Caracalus. Caracalus. Alright, uh, let's go to. Do you want to do military now? 
Greek unit upgrades. This technology enables unit upgrades for a small variety. They spelled variety wrong. Unless that's... I don't know. They spelled variety wrong. Uh, of Greek units and some AR, AOR units. You can research this technology anytime if you start a save game. Okay. Um, tactical drills. So got that. Public auction would be nice. Scholarship would be nice as well. What is this? Advanced construction techniques. Hmm. No, I don't want to do that. Wouldn't be a bad idea, though. Helps with sanitation. Man, this is a tough decision. Uh... Let's do Organized Supply. It's only going to take three turns, and it'll have a lot of benefits, and we'll be able to do a level two uh, Hellenic Settlement. All right, our public order is getting a lot better, so that's good. Glad to see that. Uh, yeah, the events, 19, characters, 11, difficulty level, 5? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we're still experiencing some provincial instability, but that's okay. That'll go away. And, uh, yeah, maybe we, uh, maybe we want to get a spy. I feel like a spy would be good. We'll use our spy to kind of scout the surrounding areas. Probably a, a turn too late, but that's okay. Alright, so we want to... Cunning, chance of wounding enemy units. If we want to do spy, and we'll do agent. Okay. Well, uh, we'll do that and let's see what our family tree is looking like. Yeah, I want to know why this is red. That concerns me. What is this? Gather support. Sure. Send GIF. Do a favor. And what is this? Declare heir. Declare who will inherit the dynasty. Alright, we're just going to kind of leave things there. What is this? send the Italian the Italian trader um, to the Arverni send them see what happens hey he has self-control so that's good all right so that's about all we can do here we're not doing a whole lot of crazy stuff um, just kind of just kind of building up getting some uh, stability in the region and uh, kind of letting everyone chill and hang out all right, we got some political intrigue. Consequences. Your diplomat has returned, accompanied by a master horseman. Your cavalry units, your cavalry recruits will be better trained. Oh, that's awesome. Let's send people out more often. Faction rises. Whoa. Where's this coming from? Oh, snap. Okay. Is this nearby? Yeah, sure is. And... Liguria. Oh my god, Liguria's been destroyed! That's not good. That's actually really bad. Oh wait, was it Rome? Oh, it was Rome. Alright, Rome. I still love you. Don't forget about me. I'm trying to be your left arm. Don't forget. Um. Maybe we should have sent the Italian trader. Or, uh, over, uh yeah, the Italian, uh, trader over there. Alright, so, um, so we can send an emissary, send this politician to promise to help them with their basic necessities, well, food at least. Okay, organize games, we can send the politician to a troublesome province to help with administration. Okay, and we can send these guys over. Cost 404 for an action. Where's the, oh, okay. 
Got Coin Forger here. Uh, sh sure, okay. Um, actually, no, we don't want that. We don't want that. Oh gosh. Okay. So let's um, we can send this guy over to Rome, right? Roma. He'll like that, right? Especially they're you know because they're Italian. I mean, I guess Rome doesn't really like Italians. They like Romans. It was kind of weird how they had a difference there. What are you gonna do? All right, so we're gonna go scout out Spain some. Uh, because I want to know what they're doing. Now that Rome is coming over, I hope they don't plan on expanding this way. Because we're friends, right? We're friends. Alright, we've got a couple more turns left on the research. Everyone's looking good for the family. Politics. Everything's still staying steady. And, while well, they hate barbarians. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's tough. That's a tough one. All right, we are respected, and we are protected, okay, from secession and civil war, but it doesn't seem like we're really in danger of any of that. So, uh, once again, we will continue uh, with just trying to get some get some big bags. Big bags that we cannot lie. All right, got some more political intrigue, um, and we get our armies can now march further. Nice little bonus from... The Roman expedition, Aerope. I don't. This, is that another? Is that another female? Like I don't understand why we, this keeps happening. We need males. We need males. All right, consecrated grounds have been completed. This year, this year in history. Okay. Cool. All right, food is looking good. And let's do... Now this isn't going to be like some kind of marketplace. So maybe we just... I mean... Yeah. We could do... Wealth from all commerce, wealth from all industry. I don't know, does an olive press count as industry? I would assume so, right? But maybe we do Hermes. Or a Shrine of Athena. We do Athena. Help with uh, research. That could be good. Let's do that. Let's do that. We do have some sanitation problem problems in the capital. Ay ay ay. Just can't win. Can't win. Alright, so we got our spy. Let's uh see what's going on over here. Oh, wow. They're not doing too good. Okay. We're just gonna scoot past here. They're about to lose that. That is hilarious. I don't know if they are friendly with me or not. I wonder if they pop up on my diplomacy now that I've ran into one of their armies. Okay, they don't really care for us. Oh, come on, man. I wonder if it is... We have no need to share glory, ale, or good pork with you. Yeah, we probably shouldn't do anything with Epirus because they are not friends of Rome. And it looks like Syracuse is becoming uh, less of a friend of Rome. I definitely don't want to be on Rome's bad side. I'm not the one to take some sort of stand. I don't want to have any relations with them because they're going to piss Rome off. I don't want to piss them off. So we're just going to leave that the way it is. And yeah, we're just going to continue our uh, continue the turns here. All right. We've got the uh, we've got the architect coming in. A noble daughter appears before you with a plea. Her mother, a very influential woman, insists on sending her to the Temple of Athena, where she has become a priestess of weaving. Okay. Humbly, the girl asks us to let her serve on the city planning council. 
from what we've heard, she's great. She's a great student of, math, of mathematics, and her tutors are indeed very proud of her. Should we intervene? Let's hire her. Let's do it. Warning, protection expired. You are still protected from secession, but this will expire in three turns. A faction rises. Iconian. Oh, no. We got an encouraged populace, so that's good. The people of this province are content with current circumstances. Well, I hope you guys are thrilled with the current circumstances. Construction complete. Olive press is done. Awesome. That is very helpful. Um, yeah, Squalor's pretty bad, actually, over here. Uh, definitely have to work on some sanitation. Does this help with it? Part of me thinks we should wait. Greek archers would be nice, though. Let's do it. Let's do it. What do we got to lose, right? We got 1,600 income. We're looking good. We're feeling good. All right, let's, uh, let's look for the city here. All right. Are they the ones that are attacking? I think they are. They are not, actually. There are three different factions here. Oh, those are those are rebels. Okay. Oh, did they stop the siege? Looks like they did. Why did they stop the siege? I mean, they even have they even have ships. Okay. Canterbury. Eravachi. All right, we've got to do some research. So do Gala Colony, Docks and Dry Dock. No. Oh. Let's do, got War Games and Training Fields. Guess we can do Public Auction? No, don't want to do that. Let's do this. It'll help with sanitation as well. Um, and that's always a that's always a good thing. Um, nope, don't want to do this. I want to go to diplomacy. And you guys are super cool, right? I give ear to your just and undoubtedly noble request. Well, okay. Want to be defensive allies? You no. are a servant of Venus, so sweetly do you speak. Okay, then. Alright, uh, I guess there's not a whole lot more for us to do here. How's the uh, Hellenic province going? Oh, sick. We're going up to 6%. Feels good. Feels good. All right, let's um do some diplomacy with these guys. They probably don't care for us. They're treacherous and aggressive. Okay. Well, they're at least reliable. Greetings to you. I trust you come with. Oh come on, man. Our ancestors were proud men and stood alone against the world. For now. Shh. Quiet, my sweet prince. All right, still can't do much in terms of diplomacy. That's super disappointing. This would be a heckin' city to take, though. Uh, but it looks like these guys are preoccupied, so we might be able to actually go after them and not really face a lot of punishment. Because I don't think... Yeah, I don't care about them. Ooh. They're pretty friendly with them, though. I don't know if that would be beneficial for us. Uh, what province? What else would I have to take from this? Nemosis and Limonium. Ugh. Sounds like a lot of work. And also, I don't think it has any resources. I think it's just a capital. Like I said, I would like to kind of stay in the Mediterranean, but we'll see what happens. All right. Faction has been destroyed. Kolkis. Damn. You hate to see it. Don't know who. They, didn't know who they were. Probably weren't too important. All right, we got the Shrine of 
Hephaestus. Hephaestus. Not very good at my Greek mythology, but it's done. That's all that matters. The video game says so. <laughs> um, all right, let's. Um, these guys are. These guys are pretty. Pretty powerful dudes. So let's, uh, let's just go past here, see if we can see another... Nope. We'll just kind of explore Spain. See what they got for us. Um, got another faction encountered. And let's see if they want to be cool. You guys want to be cool? The guards will have me listen to you, but do not... Oh, come on. I am sure that your wares will find a home I'm producing oil. Not Don't you want to do oil? You want to do the oil? No? A man is just by. Y you want... Welcome. Oh, they're already importing the oil. They probably won't done. really care. Yeah. My people are wealthy and into... What about you guys? I, I mean, I know I already asked you guys, but... You guys want some oil? We are an honest folk. Oh. I am sure that your wares will... Well, met friend. Sit and let your words move me to anger or agreement. As... I don't want to just give them payment either. To, like, sweeten the deal. But I guess what we could do... We could... Send our inland traders... Send them over there. I don't know who I was just talking to, though. Uh, the Editani. Send them. They'll have better relations. And then you guys can go to Canterbury. Try to do things that way. See how that goes. All right. Oh my god, we gotta... Oh my god, my diplomat betrayed me! I got a research penalty! <laughs> oh no! Oh, Urbitus! Am I gonna have to murder you? By his inappropriate actions, your diplomat brought a, a death sentence down upon himself. Well, you know, that's what you get, buddy. Don't cry about it. He deserved it. Jesus. So I had one guy betray me, and the other one got killed. Uh, so how do they... So, oh boy. They do not like me now. And, uh... Canterbury? Yeah. They're probably not the biggest fans of me anyway, so... Um... Yeah, you... I don't care if you seek a spouse. Can I fire this guy? Can I assassinate him? This character is not a ruling party member. I don't care. Can I just... I want him murdered. This guy's a... Oh my gosh. Hey, buddy. You want to go do something for me? Oh my gosh. Disappointed. Disappointed. Alright, well, we are steadily getting our money back up. Um, by that, I mean the income is gradually getting bigger. Uh, the Romans have left Ganua, so they are obviously uh, probably getting ready. Man, look at these stacks. Good gracious. They are probably heading south, if I had to guess. With the growing threat of... Uh, of the Carthaginians. Is this Roman? Uh-oh. That's no good. Sorry, Epirus. Hate to, hate to see that. Hate to see that. All right, let's move our spy. How can I be of assistance? That's a nice city you got there. Mind if I stay a while? These guys are scary. War Maiden? Oh, snap. Watch your butt. 
Oh, got some upgrades. Got some upgrades. We'll do... Food and growth. Yeah, I'll do that. Help with industry. And we can help with agriculture. Dang. Getting up there. So you're level three, and you are a level... You're a level three as well. Man, she is... Corrido is just flying through the ranks. She just got here. She's already almost... A little, Almost up to, uh, what's her, Niobe. Niobe. I just don't think this is a very good army. Oh, uh, I wish I had more cavalry. I mean, I guess we could swap them, but. Eh, well, okay. We'll, uh, we'll take you and you, and then we'll give you, you and you. There we go. Now that army's a little bit better. And they've got some more cavalry. That's what really matters here. Our hidden agent, agent has been exposed. Oh no. We're no longer protected by secession either. All right, let's just continue down down the coast here. How much more movement we got? Oh, can't really. Uh, yep, Epirus. See you, buddy. Who's the Tannen? All right. Uh, we didn't send... No, we couldn't send anybody. Can we put them in? Without being too pissed? Eh, let's keep it out. They're a lot happier without the military being in there. Which makes sense. Alright, um... You guys are still really nothing for us to do. This is very much a building episode. Sorry, guys. Um, but we are getting better... We are getting bigger and better. So that's, you know, that's the positive. Um... Oh, wow, that's going to add a lot of food. That's really good. And what about this? It's going to add public order. It's a negative. I don't understand how Fishmonger does that. That makes no sense to me. What about... Shrine... Oh... Yeah, let's do that. Oh, well. Why not? All right. Subject gains notoriety. The name of one of your subjects is on the lips of everyone. Whether this will prove beneficial remains to be unseen. Oh, God. Got a freaking bad omen. It's not good. Requires attention. All right. A once lame man, cured in Epidaris. Epidaris is... Walking the streets and rejoicing. The people are abandoning their homes and work to follow him on a pilgrimage to honor the gods. Miracle! Rejoice! They have healed this man. We must honor his good work. Yeah. Alright. What do we got here? We can adopt. We can adopt the character. We can declare him our heir. Actually, it's our guy. It's Xenon. Oops. We can hire politicians. Oh, how about that? Inland traders, Italian traders, populists. Do we need to hire politicians? Is that a uh, smart move? Do we not naturally develop politicians? I mean, if it's a requirement, then that's fine. Um, all right, let's just not spend money on this turn. 
And, uh, yeah, we're kind of... Uh, man, I kind of want to go after these guys. These guys are friends with those two. Like, really good friends. Prefer not to do that. And these guys are pretty... Pretty strong, it seems like. So do they. Hmm. I feel like we have to figure out a target here. Do we want to gain access to the Celtic Sea? Is it that important? Now we could take this settlement. We could work on a navy. Could raise a fleet. Assault Hexers. Let's do that. All right. Oh my God. They're so expensive. So expensive. All right, who are these guys? Supply ships. Uh, what's supply ships help provide nearby armies with supplies, both at sea and on land. They can help transfer transport force avoid attrition um and provide supply lines from the coast okay that's that's really nice greek marine archers these guys are cheaper so we'll, we'll grab a few of those guys and we'll head over here just to kind of see what's going on uh because we might be able to just go and kind of take these this is carthaginian we are not fans of the carthaginians so Maybe we just leave the rest of these guys alone. We go take take these guys and, you know, fight Carthage. I don't know. That might be the play here. Um, so we're gonna start. We're gonna start on our fleet. We are Massalia. We probably should have a fleet anyway, and uh, yeah, probably be good for the the role playing aspect of it. So, uh, but anyways, guys, that's gonna be the episode. If you guys enjoyed this. Please hit that like button and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. I know it was a bit of a dull episode, but we made a lot of progress in terms of um, structures and and income, which we just dec we kind of just decimated with our fleet. But we'll see we'll see how that goes. Um, and the fleet is called the Hydra's Head. I mean, heads. I mean, how do you deny deny that fleet? I mean, it's pretty good. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, anyways, guys, hope you have a good one, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.